After Jesus died on the cross and was raised from the dead, he spent time with his disciples. At the end of his time on earth, Jesus gave his disciples important instructions. He told them not to leave the city of Jerusalem. Jesus said the disciples should wait there until God kept his promise to give them the Holy Spirit. Jesus reminded the disciples of John the Baptist. John had baptized people with water when they turned away from their sin and turned to God. Jesus said that in a few days, the disciples would be baptized too. Not with water, but with the Holy Spirit. Lord, are you giving the kingdom back to Israel now? The disciples asked. God was with his people, the Jews, but they looked weak. The Romans ruled over them. The Jewish people wanted to have power over other nations. Jesus did not say yes, but he did not say no. The Father knows when the time is right, he said. Then Jesus said, but you will receive power when the Holy Spirit has come on you. You will be my witnesses in Jerusalem, in all Judea and Samaria, and to the ends of the earth. As Jesus' witnesses, the disciples would tell people what they knew to be true. They would tell people the good news about Jesus in the city of Jerusalem, in the surrounding area of Judea, and the nearby area of Samaria, and all over the world. The Holy Spirit would be with them to help them. After Jesus said these things, he went up to heaven. The disciples watched Jesus until a cloud hid him from their sight. All of a sudden, two men appeared. The men were wearing white clothes. These men asked the disciples, Men of Galilee, why do you stand looking up into heaven? This Jesus, who has been taken from you into heaven, will come again. He will return in the same way that you have seen him going into heaven. Then the disciples returned to Jerusalem, as Jesus had instructed them to pray and wait. Jesus left earth and returned to heaven, but he did not leave us alone. Jesus sent the Holy Spirit to be with us and help us do God's work. One day, Jesus will return to make all things new and to rule as Lord over all. <laughs>